Hello and welcome guys we are back again with another cornerstone tutorial and before we get started we're going to give away our three streamer dream key codes that's a tongue twister um i picked them randomly with a random generator we had seven people to enter which was kind of low i was hoping we'd get a lot more but we'll have it but anyways we got the beast the next one is stephanie stay cough and cobalt com you three are the winners and i'll be sending your keys via youtube and so today what we're going to do we are going to make a zombie yes an evil evil zombie and the items we will be using today um, first of all we're going to be using one bomb hopefully that's all you're going to be needing is one bomb yes and, and you'll see what what it is here in just a moment okay let's go ahead and get into this we're going to use two different types of green let's see if i can find them um we have army man and we have mossy green the next one we're going to use is uh grandma's lipstick i don't know what i didn't wake these names up so eh. the next one is salmon or salmon whatever way you want to say it salmon red and then we're going to use a black iron that's in the metallic area then we're going to be using some white and some dark gray and some primal gray if you don't have these you can substitute them for something else but let us get started we're going to do the first part of this right now i've already laid out what we got here and i also see that i, I made a little boo-boo up here so it's a good thing i noticed that right off the bat so we're going to lay lay out his jaw at the moment the bottom layer basically is what we're looking at right here now the part that I messed up which we'll have to change this out is right here we're gonna bring this all the way back to here and if you're wondering let's go ahead and check this out this is the very front of your cornerstone there'll be a sign like right here we're going to take this door out eventually, but right now we're just going to leave it the way it is. And we're one over from the edge, the edge right there. And then we're going to come back from this and you go 14 back, which is two from the back, just like that. Very simple. Boom. And there's the first part of this layout. So I'll go ahead and leave you at that and we'll be back in just a moment. Okay guys, I hope you've got that part of it done. The next thing I want you to do is I want you to fill in this outer edge right here. We're gonna go up three high. All the way like this. Don't worry about this block here. That's just a reference point. And we're gonna go up one more. Right there like that and to here and there it should look like this now mind you there's gonna be dirt right here so don't, this is only the top of the cornerstone so don't freak out because there's a green piece right there okay next thing I want you to do is come over here to your white and let's select that that's number six and we're gonna go ahead and put his little teethies not saying that he has he'll have uh, white teeth or anything like that but go put two right there and we're gonna put two right here 
So you're gonna go over one from this edge and go two. Okay, we're gonna skip a couple right here like this. And we're gonna go one, two, three, and four like that. And we're gonna go over to this other side right here. Same thing. Just like so. And there you have his teeth. Another thing that you can do here, we're gonna take these little spacings out here and we're gonna put this other color green. Just, hey dude, out of the way. Just like that. And I don't know, let's let's say Oh we forgot about our here, let's do this one first. Put one right there, and don't forget to put the teeth on this side. I forgot all about these teeth. And go ahead and take this out and put the other green, which is I forget already. Yeah, mossy green. So he's got moss between his teeth, so he needs he needs to floss better. Okay, we're gonna take this out here and do the same on this side over here. Now we're gonna switch back to our fancy, fancy other green. And we're gonna bring, put a block right here. And this is at three, okay? So we're gonna count from three four five six seven eight nine ten and eleven we're gonna go up at eleven high all together so that's three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven just like that now we're gonna go ahead and fill this in to make our little square to go all the way around so this is already at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Now, if we done this right with our calculations, oops, we're gonna have to go up a couple blocks. Are you kidding me? More than that. Okay, make sure we get at the top and go to the top of this one and. Let's just go up here. It'll be easier. There we go. And it should go like that. Very good, guys. Now, we're going to go ahead and frame this in. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Do this. Oh, we can't quite reach it over here, so we'll just jump over here. Go ahead and select that, and we'll make our way over to the other side. Boom. Do the same over here. Remember this is at three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Now we're gonna jump over here. I think we can get it from right here though. Boom. Do the same over here. Oops. Select this side right here. Jump over the whole other side. And let's put it right there. Very good, now we have our shape of our zombie. Now we're gonna go ahead and fill in, in between here. Uh, let's, get, let's, let's get rid of him for now, shall we? Oops. And you can take these off if you like. They're just a little thing, uh, a reference point or whatever you, want to call them. So let's go ahead and fill this in. All the way. Come on. There we go. Fill it in any way you want. There we go. And we should have the front all filled in. So it's starting to look pretty good, if I do say so myself. So we're going to take our black now. We're going to figure this out 
so we don't mess this up. Um, let's see here. Um, our black is number five, so we're going to want to go. Uh, let's see. We're going to want to go up here. And we're going to place our little uh, blocks right here. One, oops, two, and three. And we'll go under it, three over here. And then we're going to keep on going with this line, but we're going to go all the way to. Ah, a little bit harder to see from here. One, two, and then the third one. Boom. Because we don't want these kind of even, so we only want four for this eye because he's 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 googly eyed. So there, there's his face, guys. We got his face going at this point. So. Next thing I want you guys to do, we're going to go ahead and fill in this whole thing. And I think it will be easier if we do the back first. And I'll show you why. Go over here like this. Boom. And boom. Then we go back to the front here. And well, make me a liar. We needed one more. Oh well. Whoops, and boom. So you do most of it, and then you can get up to the front, and you can just go whoosh, 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 and make me a liar. There we go. Just like that. And it goes by so, so much faster, and we ran out. Oh, no. So let's head over here so you can tell which one this is that we need. Pop this puppy open, and we're going for Army Man. So, we're going to go ahead with uh, 300. That should be enough to carry us all the way. And let's go ahead and go back. Because it is still making those blocks for us. You don't have to sit there and wait for them. There we go. Whoops. There we go. We're getting there, guys. Trust me, this will be worth it once it's done. And then we're going to go to the side here. And we're going to... Oops. Come on. We're going to fill in this now. And to do so... It's quite easy. Once once we get the, it level with this, the mouth. Then we go back here. And then we click it right. Come on. Come on. Right there. See how easy that was. And you keep continue doing the same thing. With the, the side of the head. And I think it's much easier if we do this until we get up to where it's easy to manage. Sometimes it's easier to do top to the bottom. Just so you don't have to reach as much. I guess I could just fast forward this and make it fast and all. But... There we have that side done. We're going to continue on to this side. And we're going to go ahead and do it this way from the top to the bottom. Oops, we messed up somewhere, guys. Yep. See, now this, this is where it gets interesting. So we try to get it in that little hole right there. There we go. And do the same. What the heck happened there? There we go. 
and it's much easier to fill in this way but you guys do it however you want boom and we have one more side to do and then we get to do the fancy stuff yep you'll see what I mean there we go pop that in there like that okay that was weird uh oh uh oh we cha changed colors let's go here what's up with that okay. looks like we may run out again yet we're gonna run out again so we're not gonna need that many so let's go over here and just make a hundred of them even though we won't need that many but we'll have them on stock uh, zero zero boom and we may need some other the about pinkish colored ones I'm not sure we'll have to see but let's go ahead and switch to this uh, fill in that little hole right there okay we're almost done guys just hang in there just a little bit longer I try to make these as fast as possible so there you have his head but we can do better that's just plain plain looking little guy here let me take these off real quick because my OCD is really bugging me at the moment and that's that's just gonna drive me nuts so let's get rid of this for a second eight because that's that's just that's bugging me every time I look at the front of this okay so like I said we can do better than this yes we can and I'll show you let's go ahead and switch to this view and what we need right now we need a bomb you might say but we just built this yes but hopefully we only need to to do this once so hopefully it, everything goes goes well we might have to get rid of some of these blocks but here we go aim as close to the corner as you can go we're gonna back up a little bit and boom and it didn't do as much damage as I thought so let's go ahead and take out some of these blocks like it was being blown apart because I use a bomb to make it kind of look, you know, like it's been blown up a little bit. And something like this. Maybe not that sporadic, but... Okay, now what we're going to do, we're going to switch to our funky little number three, which is, I think, Grandma's Lipstick or something like that. Yeah, grandma's lipstick and we are just going to fill in this yes you guys got it this is his brain and then we're gonna switch back and forth on this and we're just kind of kind of being artistic and creating uh, put in little bits of his brain Oh, that was weird. I didn't want to put that there, but oh well, it worked. Now switch back again and just fill in random locations. And what we're doing is trying to make it look like his brain has been exposed from his skull. And you can just build this up any way you want. But like I said, the perfect thing is with the bomb to get it like a kind of like a natural flow to it and we switch back to number four which is the other color let's put one right there there and you can always break into some more of these blocks here um, let's put this here there there and there switch to number three and as you can see we have a bit of brain action going on so let's break this down a little bit here 
I would like to see more right here and right there. So let's do this. Switch to four. Right there. Switch back to three. Yes, that's awesome. Now, the next thing I want to do is switch to our other color green, two, and you see some spots around here like this, say, then you just pop these in. Just, come on, go in there. There we go. You can plop these anywhere you like. And then you just add these wherever you want. I like kind of doing the corners a little bit. Don't do too min too much of it though. You don't want it to look like a creeper or anything from Minecraft. There we go. Now the next thing we want to do, we want to make some raggly old hair. So what we're going to do with that, let's go ahead and get rid of this cornerstone block. And there's our gray. Okay. We're going to start off with our lighter color first, which is a number eight. And we're just going to go like this. And make it sporadic. His hair is going all over the place. Come on. Wait, there we go. Just like so. And it's going to be falling. Oops, we not us. It's going to be falling down like so. And you just basically use your own interpretation. This is almost like artwork, I guess. <laughs> not really, but kind of. Okay, and then we're going to go up here and we're going to start placing like this. Oops, oops, we ran out. But we don't need that meant that much of it. So let's go ahead and take these green blocks that we we accidentally placed. And we're gonna switch back to our other gray, which is the eight. And we're gonna do the same through here. Jump up and do this number. Like that. Make sure you don't go over your cornerstone limit. You can ha have it stick out a little bit like that, but that's fine. And you're just making a little artwork, I guess, like that. And you don't want it to stick out past your cornerstone mark again because it will be removed. And we just do stuff like that. Let's go ahead and put this here. And that is pretty much done, guys. We have our zombie. Now, the next thing, the very last thing you're going to do is take this out. This is where your sign's going to be anyway. Right here like this. That way you can go in and put all your goodies in here from your adventures, your loot boxes, and stuff like that. But guys, there you have it. That is the zombie. And it is, I would say, 90% um, just built in a box, basically, with a little bit of extras, whatnot. But I would say a good 10, 15% is artistic. That means it's on your side, what you interpretate a zombie should look like. And you can have more brains up here. I just have a little bit of brains coming out the back. You can have the brains coming up on the front or something. It's totally up to you. But there you have it, guys. I want to thank everybody for watching. Please like, share, comment, all that good stuff. And if you have Twitch, you want to watch me on Twitch, we give giveaways for streamer keys all the time. So... That look down in the description below you'll find my twitch channel and come visit me until next time catch you later goodbye